Jack Hussey, and I'm the director, writer, producer, editor, and voice actor for the Transformers Regeneration. Uh -huh. When I was 10 or 11, I saw the first Transformers movie by Michael Bay, and I loved it. But when I got older, I watched the show, and then I like the 80s cartoon, and then I realized none of the movies are really as much as I, none of the, I like the first one, but as much as I liked it, I felt like none of the live movies were accurate to the source or the lore of Transformers of like fans of like the G1 show, for example. So when I, uh, after the poor reception from Transformers 4 and 5, I decided why not make a, my own Transformers movie, something that would probably appeal better to the diehard fans of G1. And I asked all my friends, that are in the movie were, were like, what, what do you guys think? And they all agreed. Mm -hmm. The full movie will definitely be done by, well, production will be done by the end of this year. And uh, the movie, the full movie will definitely be on YouTube next year. Don't have an official date, but definitely next year. I have, uh, when I was in high school, I made a Jurassic Park spinoff movie. It was my first feature length video I ever did. Uh, about an hour long. It's on my older YouTube channel. It took me years to make. I, it, if anyone wants, uh, I got business cards where in, if you want to see any of my films, uh, sure, yeah, sure. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> and uh, well, not to brag, but I was also an extra in the Netflix original UB Halloween with Adam Sandler. Yeah. I was in the grocery store scene. <laughs> Cool. The first scene in the movie. And the only project that I have saved for the future, like I try to focus on one project at a time, but uh, anyone heard of the website Stick Page? Anyone? No? Uh, well, it's a stick figure game website. Uh, there was a show on it, a couple of shows, that I thought would make good rated R live movies. So I emailed both creators, thinking about combining both stories into one. It's uh, I got permission from both of them. It's uh, one of them was called Killing Spree. One was called Joe Zombie. But I thought this both would make a good movie, but I can't use one or the other title. So it's called Immortality. It's in the works. Uh, but yeah, we're, we're I'm currently writing it, but it will definitely not be in production until after we finish Transformers. Like I said, production will definitely be done for that for the end of this year. It will be released on YouTube next year. Most of you this year, I think, are returning. Most of you are regulars or have been here before, so you kind of know how we do things, which is fast. <laughs> Once we get going, we will get going, and it is quick. We are going to call things out by category. When you hear that category, and you hear your name, come on up. You'll get your award. You guys know what's what, right? But not who's what. Not who's what. And then we'll clap at the end of the category. If somebody's not here, the category, nobody's here, we move right on. And like Ray was saying, with you all networking all weekend long, you know, some people say, well, I want to give an acceptance speech. You've been talking to each other all weekend. And if you haven't, where have you been? <laughs> that was not as much fun here as normal. They've just heard it too many times. All right, at the end, that's where we'll give the, we're going to start with the genre awards, and then we will go on to um, the, I thought you were leaving. I'm going to have a cigarette. No, you're going to go watch the table so Christina can come in. You're going to watch the table. You're going to watch the table. This is your last year watching the table. Watch the table. Watch the table. Okay, we are moving on into trailers. Fourth place, race you. Third, Transformers. Second, Mad Scientist. First, History of Cleveland's Chinatown. Anna, you can 